everyone. Meteorologist Tim Williams here on WJZ.com with the latest update from WJZ Weather. Widely scattered and isolated storms rolling through the region. Some heavy rain. Uh, just all the remnants of Florence moving through the region. Not seeing a complete washout across the entire state. But if you're under any of these showers or storms, they can present some problems. We're dealing with some flash flood concerns. We do have several things to talk about as of this update. Tornado watch in effect remains in effect for areas from Anne Arundel down toward Prince George's, Calvert Charles, and St. Mary's counties, just really right on down into Southern Maryland until 10 o'clock. That's really until we lose the heat of the day until some of this activity calms down. But then as far as the flood concerns, we have coastal flood advisories, these bright green uh, coastal flood advisories in effect for both sides of the bay down toward the uh, mouth of the Chesapeake Bay. But the most immediate problem is the flash flood watch, just basically saying that the atmosphere is conducive to flash flooding. The positive in this is that since uh, we've checked last, right before this update, uh, the area has lessened. The flash flood watch was issued for all the way out into far western Maryland, Allegheny and Garrett counties. That area now has been uh, eliminated from this. And the flash flood advisory was in effect until 4 a.m. It is now in effect until midnight. So just looking to uh, really see some improvement here. Well, those are at least two signs. Now, we're going to be dealing with these remnants through tomorrow at least. They're moving to the northeast straight from Florida or from uh, Florence, really, up from the Carolinas on into the northeast. And we're going to be seeing some heavy rainfall and potential for that flood threat, especially along the coastline. So we've talked about that. So this is how it's all playing out. With your temperatures tonight going down to 72 degrees, the dew points are in the 70s as well. Very humid out there. We're going to remain very humid for uh, at least the next day or so. Cloudy and breezy with those spotty showers around. Some could be very strong. And then cloudy and very humid with some heavy rain tomorrow. 82 degrees is our our forecast high for Tuesday. Then 82 on Wednesday, we'll start to get some clearing, less humid conditions, very pleasant and comfortable on Thursday. Definitely the best day, probably one of the better days of the weekend. 84 on uh, Friday with a bit more humidity building into the region, a chance of a late day shower on Saturday, better chance of a shower on Sunday and into Monday with the front coming through. Our temperatures drop from the 80s down into the 70s. So again, those shower chances increase going into the weekend. But by then, Florence will be gone. So there's your latest update from WJZ Weather. Of course, we'll be here for any updates should there be any problems with tornadic activity or any severe weather that should break out through the evening. We'll see you soon.